Hey guys, it's Nikki. Welcome to my channel. I have a huge, large flat rate box that does not even fit on my desk. It is so long um, from one of my subscribers. So Suzanne, thank you so much for reaching out to me and asking to do a swap. I am so excited about doing this with you. Um, like I said, Suzanne is a longtime subscriber. She always comments on my videos. She's so super sweet and such a... Um, inspiration for me to keep crafting and she reached out and asked if I would uh, like to do a swap with her and of course I would if anybody is interested in that I will definitely love to swap with you um, so I didn't even send her mine yet we have until September 30th to finish them and I received this huge box already from her so let me go ahead and just take everything out and um, then we'll get into what it is <laughs> Okay, look how gorgeous that is. Suzanne, you have to tell me where you got that from. That is beautiful shred. This tinsel is so fine and so pretty. I'm gonna save every ounce of that. And I know I've got some on the floor and I've got some of these uh, little balls on the floor and my cats are like circling my feet like sharks. So <laughs> I know that I have some down there. I wanna tuck this away because I am definitely gonna reuse that. Oh, I love that so much. Okay. So the first thing are these amazing witch feet. Look at these. Did you make these? You have to tell me if you made these. These are so fun. I cannot wait to put those like coming out of a wreath or something. It is so cute. So, so cute. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I absolutely love those. Okay. Okay. I have everything situated. I opened the box. Look how funny that is. So she, when you open the box, these two huge eyeballs are there. So I, I needed to show you that. That was so cute. Okay. Now, let me get you guys straight, and we will get into the video. I love these witch legs, so I need to have these like, like that. Okay, so here first is her card. Super cute stickers on there. I like that. That's kind of raised, kind of textured. That's cute. Oh my gosh, that is such a cute card. Oh, I'm totally going to save that. Oh, thank you so much, Suzanne. You are so sweet, and I am so, so excited for this swap. So first of all, she sent me these stickers, which are so cute. I've never seen this before. I don't even know what brand this is. Look at um, their little tags or little um, uh, dimensional stickers. So those will be so cute to layer. I love that. That is my absolute favorite right there. Bride of Frankenstein. So, so cute. All right. So the first thing is a memory decks card. So we were going to swap a memory decks card. Um, and she wrapped it in this really, really cool um, wired ribbon. That is awesome. That is so cool, so spooky. Let's definitely save that. Okay, so first of all, she has got this chunky charm on here. How cute is that? So she's got this like Jack Skellington bell, a little orange um, star bobble, a skull, a silver skull, and then this really cool black cat charm. That is so neat. And then down here, she's got the hand from uh, Dollar Tree. And then she's got a little uh, bat sticker down here on the bottom. So I know there's a glare, so sorry about that. So cute. She's got so much dimension on here. So she used the felt stickers here and here. And then layered, she's got brads in each corner of this one. She's got the cat and she added a little um, diamond collar. That is such a cute little touch. And then a dimensional uh, pumpkin. Is that a brad? Yep, a brad there. This one is so cute. So she's got a sticker spider web and then these dimensional spiders. And here she's got, oh, I love this. I love this so much with the hearse and then a little cat and ghost peeking out the back. Um, this is a dimensional uh, popped up word sentiment there. 
She's got a little shaker pocket here. That's so cute. And little dimensional bat here made out of wood. And then here she's got, oh, this cute bat trim. I love that. Where's that from? That is so cute. Oh, Suzanne, I absolutely love it. Oh my gosh. You painted this. You did such a good job. Oh, wow. I saw these there. So she actually painted that. Look how great that looks. And, uh, oh, the light actually changes color. That is neat. You're not going to be able to see it because my ring light is on, but oh, maybe can you see inside there? That is so cool. Oh, I'm definitely going to put this on my shelf. That is so neat. Really great job painting. Oh, what's next? Okay. This feels like a house shape, maybe like a wood block or something. Oh, so cute. I love this sign from Dollar Tree. This is one of their um, best made signs, I think. I think that is so well done. Welcome, my pretties. Love the witch theme. Oh, what next, what next? I think I'm gonna go with this. I bought this same container, just in a different size. Um, and then she's got, oh, I like these little spiders, these little dimensional spiders on there. She has Boo, um, probably a die cut, right? That's a die cut and a little bat with googly eyes. So cute. Oh, I love, love, love this. I always say all the time, and I don't know if that's why you sent these, Suzanne, but I think it's so amazing when people swap dies because everybody doesn't have all the dies. So when you send die cutouts as a, as a fun little swap, I think that is such a great idea. So this is a Dracula, which I absolutely love. Little vampire. I'm read that out this is oh my gosh these are a hoot this is like a uh, Frankenstein this is so funny I cannot wait to use these pieces I love these thank you for sending these I think that is such a great idea this one is a skeleton oh my gosh. these are so hilarious and you picked perfect colors. So she's got holographic, she's got like a, a tan and then orange and black. So cute. Oh my gosh. And then a ton of bats in the same colors, but that would be cute in a sequin mix. Those would be great pieces and they're nice and flat. And then she's got more of that trim down here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love these so much. Okay, pack that up and I'm gonna set that over here. All right, I'm going to save the biggest one for last, so I'm going to go with this one next, which I love how you wrapped these. It looks like a big piece of candy. So cute. And more wired ribbon. I'm only going to reuse this, guys. That's cute. I think I've seen that at Joanne. I just want to untie this, so... Make sure that it flattens out so I can reuse it. Oh, this is cute tissue paper too. Look, it's got different pumpkin faces on it. I really like that. I wish I could save it, but I think there's any way I'm gonna be able to. No way. Oh my gosh, this looks amazing. Wow, you have everything packaged really well. This is so creepy and cool. Oh my God, do you guys see this eye? That is incredible. You have to tell me how you did that. Did you build that up with something? Is that clay? That is a glass eyeball on there. Oh my gosh. And then she added these skeletons. Look at this back. Oh my gosh, you know, this reminds me of that spell book in Hocus Pocus. 
look at and that is the teeth is how it stands up and this is like those plastic teeth cut in half and then distressed this is so cool okay oh my god look at the chain on the bottom did you add that too there's so much detail on here and your painting is unbelievable oh, does it open i don't want to break it oh my god this is so cool are you guys ready so she has the inside all glued maybe it's mod podge and then she put the red glitter on and she's got the little um like oracle or charm here oh my god and then the skeleton with the freaking knife through his heart that is hilarious oh my god i cannot wait to display that suzanne that is so cool that is so cool. Thank you so much. That eye, seriously, this eye. I could look at that all day. That is so creepy and cool. Oh my gosh. You are talented. Okay. Let's have some, some shake to it. Take these off so I can save these too. Oh, this one's different. Very cute. I like the way it bats. This is cute tissue paper too. Oh, that is such a great idea. And I have these. I never thought about using them for Halloween. These are the little gumball machines from Hobby Lobby. Oh my gosh, let me get it open so you guys can see it. Oh my gosh, it's so simple but so Perfect. Look, at it's just tied with like an elastic ruffled trim around it. Let me get that out of the way. And then inside are these plastic, oops, did I, I think one actually, one actually fell out of here. That's cool. Do they, can you turn them? Maybe that one was just, was just there. Um, so there's plastic bones and these plastic bats. Those are really cool. Look at what those look like. That is so so awesome. Suzanne, thank you so much. You thought outside of the box so well. Oh my gosh, I'm really, really taken by that. That is really cute. All right. No, not. Okay, a couple more things. Let's see. I'm going to go with this one next. This one is, feels soft. Oh, this is what she said. Oh my God, you guys. Wait until you see this. Okay, so she, in her note, wrote that she followed a tutorial. <clears throat> and I'll link the tutorial down below. I can't remember who it was, who um she followed. Oh my God, are you guys ready for this? Look at this cat. Oh my gosh. So you must be able to buy this form. Is this a Dollar Tree form? I have to watch that tutorial. This is the cutest thing I have ever seen in my life. So she used this like soft chenille yarn. If I get close up. Oh, and then the collar, these ears, I'm dying. I have got to watch the tutorial. So she made this, you guys. My mouth is like jaw dropped. My jaw is on the floor. This is so freaking cute. Just stare at him all day. Oh, I love him. I think he's gonna have to hang in my craft room uh, year round. <gasps> so cute. Okay, I have to think of a name for him too. Uh, link or suggest a name down in the comments. I am in love with him. Okay, and then I have this. This feels like a book. Oh, Suzanne, you are so thoughtful so we had to do a halloween surprise and a, a christmas surprise that were store-bought um and this is what she sent so she lives in oregon and she sent this santa's sleigh is on its way to wisconsin that is so cool i have never seen this before oh my gosh this is so cool and they must have one for every state i'm thinking 
I'm wondering if there's got to be like a cheese head or oh, Eau Claire, Mequon, Milwaukee. Those are all towns in Wisconsin. I'm thinking there's got to be like Packers or a cheese head. Danny Park. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so cute. So, so cute. <gasps> Appleton, that's where I live. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. What a thoughtful gift. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my gosh, I'm really going to have to up my game when I uh, send my swap to you. This is unbelievable. Okay, so I think I need to make some room here because the last thing is quite large. All right, buddy, you got to just come over here for a minute. These are going to just go on top of him for a second. Okay, so she sent it packaged so nice. So, like, it's in, like, a sheet protector. So, it is, like, waterproof, kind of, um, in case the box had gotten wet. This is such a great idea. I'm going to save this to reuse it. Look, at, it's like a sheet. It's what your sheets come in. That's genius. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna have to slide this off. Whatever this picture is, I'm dying. Look at it, looks like somebody like clawed at it. Oh my God, Suzanne, you're so creative. <gasps> Can you guys see the holographic of this picture? It is so creepy. <gasps> oh my gosh. Is that, does that come across on camera? It's like, um, yeah, like holographic where it looks three dimensional in my face. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is my loaded envelope. So that was like the protector of it. I love it. Okay, so these were glued on, but they fell off. That's not a big deal. I will glue those back on. All right. Let me get this. I love that so much. Oh my God. You must love Halloween. I bet you decorate in spooky, creepy, awesome, like, um, decorations. This thing is packed full. Look at this envelope. So she made an envelope out of um, 12 by 12 paper. It's got that awesome scene on it there. Okay. Oh, I love these witch hats. These witch hats from Dollar Tree are amazing. Is this a pen? Oh my God, I love fun pens. Oh, it's so soft. So soft. Thank you so much for that. I'm definitely going to use that during October. These rosettes are cool. Is that the die? So this looks like the fancy rosette die, kind of, um, except... That one folds in here a little bit, but these are really, that's a really neat die, whatever that is. Oh my gosh. Did you make that? Where did you get these feet? I need that. That is the cutest embellishment I have ever seen. I'm never going to use that. Oh my gosh. So she took that tool from Dollar Tree and created the skirt. This is cray paper. This is a little spider on there in this bow. I need to know where you found these legs. That is so cool. Okay, what next? She made some brooms. I love these crepe paper brooms, guys. These are so cool. And the more you fluff them, the better they look. Oh my gosh, look at all these colors. Love those. Love, love, love those. Oh, and another one. I got one in each color. So cool. Oh, here's another rosette in gold. That is really neat. Oh my God, here's another one. Oh, so she used the purple tool this time, which I don't have any purple tool. I need these witch feet in my life. I need to know where you got those. Oh my God. Oh, fun. Oh, this is a clip bat. Is that Dollar Tree? Is that from Dollar Tree? That is cool another one. Oh, I'm dying over these. So this is the green tool and the green crepe paper. <gasps> Suzanne. Oh my gosh. Look at this dimensional tag. Oh my gosh. You guys. Okay. I craft with like cutesy Halloween and these like creepy. This is inspiring me so much. I have got to change my theme for next year. 
This is really cool. This is almost like the stuff from Joann's without the silver in it. That is neat. Oh my gosh, look at that spider. Then she took this, this, is this like a sprig from Dollar Tree? And then she um, distressed this skeleton walking back there. This um, picture she used as the backdrop. Put this cat in there. That is so cool and so dimensional. That is really neat, Suzanne. Oh my God, another one. I cannot get over these. I want to make a banner with these and hang them on my wall. Look at those. Uh, please tell me where you got these these feet from. Oh, dying over those. So cute. Oh, very cool. Oh, look at that goes together. I love it. So a little list pad. I'll definitely keep that in my crafty room and use it. And she's got another hand in here, a spider. Oh, look at these cool bottle cap charms. Oh, wow, those are really neat. I gotta take this out of here. So is it the glass that's a different color? They look like holographic or shiny or something underneath. That is so unique. I can't figure that out. Do you guys see the shine on there? That is so cool. So I don't, it's either the glass that makes it look like that or it's the picture itself. They almost look like they're backlit. That is really, really cool. Oh my gosh, you guys, wait till you see this envelope. Look at this. <laughs> this little pocket, how cute is that? Oh my gosh, I love this. That is adorable. That is so cute to put your little, little things in there. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. I love that. Okay, and then look at her envelope. So it is a shaker envelope. So this is just filled with sequins in there. How cute is that? Oh my gosh. Suzanne, I absolutely love everything that you sent. I can tell that you just put your heart and soul into everything that you made and you've inspired me to try a different um, genre of crafting. I'm definitely going to have to look into getting some spookier collections. This is just unbelievable. Thank you so much for swapping with me. I hope I can do you justice when I um, send you your package in return. Thank you guys a million um, for watching and uh, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.